Good morning, class of 2019. I'm Mr. Moeller, and I'm here with the lovely Mrs. Turner. We are reporting to you live from the cafeteria courtyard this morning during our very first official nighttime period. So what we're going to do today, uh, we're going to play a little trivia game with you interacting with us and being the participants. So with that said, you are going to be part of a trivia game where we give you our Twitter feed, our Twitter handle, which is at NPenHS, the, the official Twitter handle of North Penn High School, at NPenHS. So load up your Twitter accounts right now. We're going to throw out a question to you, and you are going to respond. So the first person to respond accurately is going to be deemed the winner. And with that said, you actually aren't winning. Uh, one of us will actually <laughs> be losing. So I'm going to turn it over to Mrs. Turner right now to explain the game a little bit further, but at NPenHS. Ms. Turner? Thank you, Mr. Muller. What I have in front of me is a dozen eggs. Half are hard-boiled eggs and half are raw eggs. When the person responds with the correct answer, the first person, if you are a student with a last name beginning A to K, K then K. Mr. Muller wins and I have to pick an egg and crush it on my head. Darn right. And hopefully, if your last name begins L through Z, I win and Mr. Muller has to crush the egg on his head. No, A through K's got this one, Mrs. Turner. Oh, I think we've got it. Hmm. So, what's our first question? All right, so just a reminder of the rules. At NPenHS, I'm having people follow us right now, so I'm seeing that it's working. Uh, what you're going to do is tweet your response with the answer and your name, okay? Because your name may not match up with your, your Twitter handle. So, answer and name, all right? So, here we go. First question. We all know... The, the sophomore home office is the office that Mrs. Turner and I work with and the students we work with are sophomores. It's located in the front of the building. We all know that. However, here's your trivia question. What is the letter and number associated with the sophomore home office? The letter and number associated with the sophomore home office. First to tweet it wins or, like we said, loses on this end of the table. <laughs> so let's go into the alphabet. While you guys do that, Oh, we got our first answers coming in. We're going to don the battle dress, ladies and gentlemen. Little poncho action here. We do have our responses in, so we'll get to that in a moment. I'm going to go hoodless, so I actually can mess up my hair here. Yeah, uh, well, what hair? Mrs. Tur oh, jeez, <laughs> tough crowd. Mrs. Turner, hoodless for you? No. No? Okay. <laughs> Fair enough. I have some meetings I have to go to after this. <laughs> All right, so let's get that shower cap on there. Okay. Fair enough. I, th I think we're going to be going to the dry cleaner later today. All right, so first winner, mm, sorry, Mr. Nicholson is not allowed to win. So <laughs> <laughs> even though he decided to post, he can't win. But congratulations to, Dre to Jake Drellick, and I apologize if I, if I pronounce uh -oh. that incorrectly. What letter is that? That is a D. So team oh. A through K, Team Muller wins the first round. So okay. Ms. Turner, okay. all you, pick your, pick your favorite well, egg. Well, we do not know because Bernie came and he shuffled up the egg. Shuffled so I up. don't have any idea which mm -hmm. one it's going to be. So pick and drop the bomb. Okay, here we go. Uh, uh, wait a second. Uh, oh. Do it harder, do it harder just for effect. No. Nothing there. Hard boiled. Fair enough. Woo! Fair enough. All right. So even though we won there, we actually didn't win because it didn't smack all over her head. So we're going to go to question number two here. All right. So question number two. We're going a little bit outside of North Penn High School here. A little trivia for you. A little pop culture. So what superhero, remember, at Penn, N Penn HS, what superhero leads a civil war? Turn Come it over on. to you. End of the alphabet. Let's go. Class of 2019, Come looking on. for a winner here. We want to see Mr. Muller with egg on his head. No, no, we don't want that. Can't mess up this masterpiece. All right, we have a winner. Captain America is correct. This is coming from Zoe or Zoe 
Robinson. All right? Yes. So that is an R. That's yeah. mine. All, all right. right. So we'll put this one aside. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh, tough decision here. Yeah. I boiled them. Once so. you touch it, it's yours. Yeah. Shake that sucker up. Uh, <laughs> I don't have a good feeling about this. Ah, <laughs> nice. All right. We got another hard-boiled one. So we're okay, going to go to question number question. three. We're running out on time, so I want to be diligent about it. Next one. Last week we had an assembly. What was the name of the rock band that played at the Financial Literacy Assembly last week? Go, class of 2019. Come on, you know this. Let's get an answer. End of the alphabet. What was the name of the rock band that played last week? Repeat the Twitter chat. At NPENHS, we do have a winner. I'm sorry, goofing is not correct, uh, but the correct answer is Gooding. And look at this. We Jake Drellick comes in again for uh, a team bowler. Jake, you're uh, the man. Come and see me later. We'll talk about grades not, and some other things. Okay, here we're we gonna go. We're going to turn it over to Mrs. Turner. Here we go. We're egg smash. Okay, here we go. This is a winner. I'm going to buckle up for oh, safety here. Oh, it's wrong. This is a, this is a good one. Oh, my goodness. What's it's not rigged. Thing? It's not oh rigged. We got, we got a minute left. Oh, wait. No, come on. Get that on there. Get that on there. <laughs> look at this. you got to crack that egg really hard. Come I on. Look, crack it. look at this. Look at I the two did it. I did egg. it. Uh, look at that. Nice. All right. I think we got time for one more question before we turn it over to the counselors. All right. In what year? In what year? I know uh, uh, the, the voice of North Penn is going to appreciate this one. But in what year did the N Penn, the North Penn baseball team, win its last PIAA state championship? In what year? What was the last year that they won their PIAA state championship? Come on, we gotta find Come on one class there. of 2019. Ugh. Did we bring any towels? Oh my goodness. Quick, quick trigger. Jake Drake. Oh, wait a second. Coming through again. No, you have to do this one. Come on. Oh Come my on. goodness. If Come I on. go to Alex Gilbert, she comes up with 2015. We have to go three deep to Allison Can I Warren. Come Allison Warren. Oh. <laughs> oh. Ladies and gentlemen, with, with that, we're going to turn it over to your counselors from the K-25 sophomore home office. Have a great day.